Hi, welcome back. So in my daily Office 65 vlogs, we've been talking about uh, task management, especially Microsoft Planner. So in the last two videos, we looked at task collaboration and uh, how you could actually collaborate with multiple people uh, on, on Microsoft Teams. We looked at how you could actually assign a task to multiple people. We also looked at how you could use comments section within the task to uh, again uh, do the collaboration. We also, in, in the last video, we looked at using Microsoft Teams and, you know, uh, and, and you know, sharing conversations around a task and collaborating on it. So um, in this video, I actually wanted to talk about, still stay on the topic of collaboration, but how you could actually collaborate with external users. Microsoft Planner does actually allow you to uh, collaborate with guest users. So let's look at how you could do that. So here we are on a, uh, a plan, uh, the same plan that we used for the previous two examples. So here you can actually see you got uh, 18 members on here, right? Uh, there's just like, like other Office 65 apps, there's no easy, straightforward way for you to say collaborate with additional, you know, um, external users. So here I'm actually uh, logged in as a as, as Megan in my Contour so Office 65 tenant, and if I wanted to share with say my my actual account Office 65 account, I you know I can't it, it can't go it doesn't actually find me in here. So the the reason that for the reason for that is uh, Microsoft Planner doesn't actually recognize uh, uh, you know until otherwise you actually uh, add a an external user to the to 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 the Office 65 group first. So you need to actually remember this. You need to add a the external user to Office 65 group that the planner is associated with, and then you can actually use the uh, the external user that you just added uh, within your uh, within your plans. So for that, how you do that? You just rather than going to members here, uh, rather than going and clicking on the members section here, what you need to do is just click on the three dots next to schedule and click on members. What it does is it actually opens the Office 365 Outlook um, membership section. And here you can see the guest option. So click on the guest option and click add members. And here you can actually add invite external users. So I'm going to invite external users like so guest, you add them and then you click save. What it does, it automatically sends an email to uh, the, uh, the external user that you just added. And now, if I actually come back into the planner, that's the quick notification I got uh, regarding the actual uh, adding myself to the, to the Office 65 group as an external user. All right, now you could actually see that uh, jag at modernwork.academy is, is now added to the members list. So now if I actually open up a, any task and click plus and start typing add and add, you can start adding external users that way. So that's how you actually add external users and collaborate with external users in Microsoft Planner. So there you have it. Uh, that's how you do external collaboration, uh, collaborate with external users in Microsoft Planner. Hope you've learned something new today. My name is Jag Kakarlapuri and have a website called uh, modernwork.cloud where I do daily Office 65 learning videos and also have a online learning academy. It's a free access. Highly encourage you to check it out as well. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next one.